Stretch your legs in the front. Sit in the Padmasana. Keep your feet high on your thighs, just close to your abdomen. Place your left arm behind your back, crossing your right arm and try to reach round till your left hand is close to your right hip. Now, bow forward a little, twist your trunk to your right side and try to grasp the right thumb of toe. Resting on the left thigh firmly with the index finger and the middle finger. Sit straight and remain in the position for a few seconds. And breathe normally. Benefits of Baddha Padmasana It makes your legs flexible. It stretches the joints of shoulders, wrists, back, elbows, hips, knees, ankles and makes them more flexible beneficial in the shoulders and back pain it improves the posture of the spine it increases the range of the shoulder movements it is beneficial in constipation and improves the functions of digestive system daily practice of this asana is beneficial in arthritis helps to make your spine straight now release your hands and open the foot lock and come back to the initial position. Precautions of Baddha Padmasana If you have pain in your knees, do not practice this posture. If your knee has recently undergone surgery, then you should not do it. Baddha Padmasana should not be done to those people who are troubled by back pain and shoulder pain. If you have sprains in your feet, then you should not refrain from this posture. Pregnant women should not do Bad Padmasana. Stay healthy, stay positive, stay happy. Thank you.